at verse 23. And I'm going to show you why so many people are going to bust hell wide open. It says, for if, for then if any man should say unto you, lo, he is Christ, or there, believe it not. This is Christ telling you this out of his own mouth. He's telling you this out of his own mouth. Because some people are going to tell you Christ is over here. Oh, this is the church of Christ. Don't fall for it. <laughs> Don't fall for it. You got some dumb men over there teaching you about it. You got some dumb men telling you this stuff. Yahweh Shai himself telling you out his own mouth what these men is doing. And he goes on more. It says, for there shall arise false Christ. Who's telling you this? Christ telling you this and people sitting there saying he ain't telling you about another Christ. It's only one Jesus in the Bible. He's telling you false Christ. Including false prophets. I don't know what part we miss here. He's telling you about all these different ones, but people, well, no, it's only when he's talking about anybody. So when a fool come and tell you about another one, he got you. Why? Because he's telling you whatever he want to tell you and you buy it. And it says, including show great signs and wonders in so much that if it were possible, they shall f deceive the very elect. Meaning the ones that are not being deceived, but they're good at doing it. Those are the ones that, that that's holding on to it. But you got a lot of them going to be fooled by this. You got a lot of them going to be fooled by this. Because they go into these buildings and they believe those buildings... Christ is there. Christ already telling you he don't reside in buildings made with hands. You can't find one church on earth where Christ reside. Not one. But this is the problem that we have today. So as Paul sitting there telling us clearly, clearly, for every house is built by some man. It's built to him for him to make sure he, he can take care of him. And the first thing we'll do, we'll sit there and say, well, no, this 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 the house of God. Okay, it's the house of it's the house of that man. Many of us gonna bust hell wide open for that alone. And People will sit there, oh, he's speaking of the devil. Okay, same thing that he's saying here when we look at John, and, and he's going to make some more stuff even more apparently clear for us. In John chapter 5, we pick it up at verse 30 and see what it says here. And again, he's talking. He's talking. He says this, and he makes sure this is it completely clear. He says, I can of my own self do nothing as I hear I teach. He judge. He teach. In my doctrines and teachings is just because I seek not my own will, but the will of the Father which has sent me. He's clear. But you got these men that built these places unto them. And then the first thing you want to do, you go in there, they got pictures up on them. Oh yeah, he the one started the church. He did, he ain't nothing but a fool. Who done set up this place? Oh, so that was my daddy. Then your daddy was a fool. Well, what was my mama? Your mama was a fool. She built these places unto themselves. He said he don't dwell in places made with hands. That's why he says, he's telling you, for every house is built by some man. M-A-N, man or woman. And the main thing he says this, and you will see, and they do this, and they make sure it's clear. In verse 31, it says this, if I bear witness of myself, my witness is not true. They'll tell you this man, oh man, he, oh, he was this, he was that. Oh, he was this godly man. You got this one priest, they talking about he preached this man sober. And I asked them, because I knew who they were talking. They said, they said, this preacher was so good, he preached this man sober. And I asked them, I said, what was the name of that man that he did like that? And I asked the ones who knew that original guy. None of them never gave me their name. The reason why? Because it was a lie. It was a bold-faced lie. 
because they want to sit there and he and, and the man who started that church was a pedophile. But they want to sit there and hold this man as some great man. In these churches, as it says right there in Hebrew, for every house is built to some by some man. It's built to him to where he can sit there and he can make money from it. It'll take care of him. Then these false Christs and false prophets, they're going to bring in their secret changers to deceive you of the truth. It tells you, it tells you right here. It tells you exactly what it's going to do all right in here. They're going to get you. They're looking to get you for these things. This is what they're looking to do. So Paul is letting us know clearly what's going on. And these false Christs and these false prophets... They're going to bring you into these secret chambers. They're going to deceive you of the truth. And the first thing they do, as it said right here in verse, in verse 25, it says, Thou hast built thy high place on every head of the way, on every street, like whores. 